This is a uh, Cherry Les Paul Sunburst guitar. It's one of the greatest uh, rock and roll guitars ever made, and I've enjoyed uh, playing one for years and years, though it is not the first Les Paul guitar that I ever played. The first Les Paul guitar that I ever did play was a black fretless wonder that was given to me by my guitar teacher, a man named Tony Tenaglio, uh, in the suburbs of Chicago in Glencoe, Illinois. And uh, for years, uh, about a year preceding the time that I got that guitar, I used to love to pour through Gibson catalogs, and the Les Paul section was my favorite section of the catalog because those were indeed the flashiest guitars. Right around the time when I was using this, I started noticing that in Europe, European guitar players were picking up on this model guitar as well. Keith Richards had played one in the past, and Clapton was currently playing there. When the Butterfield Band went to Europe in 66, we noticed, I noticed that Peter Green was playing a uh, red Les Paul like this, Sunburst uh, Cherry one, and uh, Eric was playing one, Clapton was playing one. And I wondered to myself, how did they know that this guitar had all the inherent qualities of sustain, volume, and tone that was just better than any other possible uh, rock and roll guitar at that time. But the, they had known, the word had gotten out. I guess they had experimented by using or trying the guitars. And so we found ourselves, this little triumvirate or quartet of very influential American lead guitar players all playing the same Dang. guitar. Well, my no. God, I wish that, uh, uh, you know, this is a good guitar, Eric, and maybe you should get one too, but all of us, unbeknownst to the other, was playing the same model guitar. Now, I don't know if this guitar is particularly Les's guitar of choice. Uh, I've always used to fantasize that Les Paul, when he would play, that he had the souped up guitars that were just, you couldn't tell, they were like what you I don't know if this guitar is particularly Les's guitar of choice. Uh, I've always used to fantasize that Les Paul, when he would play, that he had the guitar. I don't know if this guitar is particularly Les's guitar of choice. Uh, I've always used to fantasize that Les Paul, when he would play, that he had the I don't know if this guitar is particularly Les's guitar of choice. Uh, well, I've always used to fantasize that Les Paul when he would play.